I guess the point I'm trying to make about all this is that it's about acceptance, really, uh, when it comes down to uh, acceptance. If you're going to be friendly with somebody, if they're in your family uh, or they, uh, they, want, they want to be your friend, and they're a little bit different, uh, if you're going to be their friend, you accept them for what they are, right? Yeah. <laughs> Like the old song says, <laughs> Jeremiah. <laughs> was a bullfrog. <laughs> he was a good friend of mine. <laughs> I never understood a single word he said. <laughs> but I helped him drink his wine. <laughs> Oh yeah, he always had some mighty fine wine. <laughs> now, here's the point. I don't know why anybody would want to have an alcoholic frog as a friend. <laughs> but if that floats your boat, have at it, you know? Like if I call you up and I say, hey Joey, let's go bowling. Right, and he says, Oh, yeah. Well, you know, uh, well, come on, we talked about you asking me out on a date. I, you know how I feel about dating trans women. I go, no, you transphobic bastard. <laughs> not a date. It's not a date. It's bowling. Bowling. The only balls I want to touch are bowling balls. <laughs> he goes, oh, okay, that's fine. Uh, uh, do you mind if I bring uh, Jeremiah? <laughs> I'm like, the frog? He's like, yeah, go, the frog can bowl? He goes, of course he can. He can bowl. He got, can't, he's got the little web fingers. You can't get him in the ball. You know, and we can't find shoes for his little web feet. No, he can't bowl, but, but he likes to keep score. <laughs> So the frog can keep score? He goes, oh, yes. He always keeps a mighty fine score. <laughs> so here's the point. Uh, <laughs> oh, there's a point, trust me. I know at the beginning of that story, you would go, what the hell is she talking about? But there's a point. Uh, the thing of it is, it, it, I want to be more like my friend, Imaginary Joey, you know? When the, well, you didn't think he was real, did you? No, come on. Who has a best friend who's an alcoholic frog? No. It's a fable. I just told you a famous fable. It's a very famous fable from Aunt Julia's book of very famous fables. They're known all over the world. Oh, this one's not, you can go to the far reaches of the world and everybody knows the story of Joey and the frog who wanted to bowl. <laughs> but, but couldn't because webbed fingers and you. Know. So, and even if you go, to, you go to a place like Norway, they know this thing. Little children in Norway know this. Of course, in Norway, uh, this story is known as Joey, Og Froskin, Somville, Bowl. 